Hello and welcome to Wolfman Gaming. This is my Spider-Man 2 blind playthrough. And uh, in the last episode there was a lot of exposition, there was some planting. And not much action going on. <laughs> and I think that I may have found what the photo op is. Could it be these two playing chess? Maybe not. Because when I scan this area, that is what I get. So it should be those two. Just not sure. How <laughs> Never mind. I Maybe if I run away. Maybe if we take an angle from up above. Nope. Never mind then. I guess we'll head on to the next mission instead. But bef something's burning. Looks like one of Marco's memory crystals Miles told me about. I should check it out. Yes, let's do the memory crystal. I need to get some... Oh, so it's not a fire, it's a sandstorm. I need to get some combat practice in, so let's do this. What I've seen the questions about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? So many puns and I don't even know where to start! <laughs> Any chance we make this easy? And as you can see, I'm doing a little bit better when it comes to combat. And knowing how things work, I probably just jinxed myself by saying that. it now to see what's inside the crystal maybe I'm being paranoid but everywhere I go I see them too work the corner store in the park they're tracking us Marco made a lot of enemies I wonder if they finally caught up to him Yeah, who knows. But... I've also got some suits. Hybrid suit. Kumo suit. Still ugly as hell. Amazing suit. Yeah, that feels kind of classic. I think. But that's not what I was supposed to do. Uh, focus. What's this? Make Do 10% more damage. Basic damage is now 110%. Yes, please. forward hmm. can we focus upgrades that increases focus which allows you to heal yourself and do finishes more effectively can't afford it hmm. uh, 
That's too bad. But we have some skill points. I want to focus more on the skills that affect both of them. Uh, that could be quite useful. Uh, abilities are partially charged after a perfect dodge. Yes. Normal enemies who are parried drop their weapons. Nope. Could be a good thing. So, now we can continue onwards and progress with the story. And as I said, these web wings, I did actually a little trophy run. I had to go from the financial district to lit, what's called Little Astoria or something, which is basically on the other side of the map. And you had to do it by using only your web wings. I'm at the bridge, but there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh man, we were sure it was there. <sighs> Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it, we'll find it. <laughs> uh, littering? Come on, man. It's the screaming for vengeance bird. Yeah, get your bug straight. There is a lot of stuff going on. Seriously though, where'd your boss take Lee and guard it? Your criminals? Not far. They're enjoying their freedom. That's not ominous at all. Uh shit. Craven was wrong about you. I think it's quite interesting with this suit. The metal thing he has going down by his jawline makes him look like tech Amish. <laughs> That is so God of War, that pulling off the wings thing. I love it. <laughs> and I must say, I haven't played the latest God of War game, Ragnarok. Because uh, I was one of those people, unpopular opinion incoming. I wasn't a huge fan of uh, the whole Norse mythology thing. For one thing, I don't didn't think it suited very well and I've said it before I might as well say it again justify my unpopular opinion so to speak but I thought that the new God of War yeah sure it was it was a good game 
but it wasn't a good God of War game. So take a look around. That is my honest opinion. I've talked about it before because I think a lot of God of War is about having these huge bosses and quite high paced brutal combat and having Kratos just walking around for, for a lot of time just talking to Atreus and Mimir and I never found that I didn't think that was super interesting and also I think the boss fights in that game were severely lacking because there were a lot of reuses uh, this is heading south quickly Railguns are such a cool thing. First time I ever heard of that that thing was in uh, an old action movie, movie starring Arnold Schwarzenegger called Eraser. Where he, as always, plays some kind of special agent. And I'm almost spitballing here because I think it's been 20 years since I last saw that movie. Mind if I take a look under the hood? Hey, ho, ho. easy there, down. cowboy, cowgirl. That's two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. A scorpion is? Okay. Okay. Let's throw some shit with people. Close to taking me down. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. And yet you always held back. Can we send her ass? <laughs> of Killing course, really I hit the thing. lights. <laughs> Because I felt she was kind of the biggest threat up here. And something I've learned playing these games is getting rid of the biggest threat. Like sending their asses packing off a rooftop or something like that if you get the chance. Really helps things out. Makes combat so much more easier. Maybe I can test something out. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. But doesn't he look a bit Should like Tech a... Amish with that metal yep. plating? <laughs> oh, is that your home? Oops. I guess that's one way of doing it. Send this location to MJ. Maybe she can take up some building records. Where are we going now? I don't know, but we're getting there fast. Hey, MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, it's fire. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. I need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. If you attack enemies with 
unsure I uh, hazard icons other enemies will know gotta drop one of them away <laughs> and that is something I remember fondly from uh, the previous installments doing like these fast. stealth takedowns, Find these self stealth sections. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. Connection we should celebrate later after later. you're done with your current work totally talk soon so where am i supposed to go nothing there ah That looked kind of savage. That face plant. <laughs> Two of the flags have stopped responding. The spider has been seen in your area. Prepare the beast. Yes, Craven. That's their leader. Where did he? I track poachers for the parks, but when I'd find them, I was harsher than my bosses would have preferred. Idiots. After the sixth incident, I got put on, what do they call it, a uh, leave of absence, so I torched their building. Hmm. Nice. Hold up in my place afterwards and waited for him to come for me. But it was Craven who did it. Asked me if I wanted to hunt real game. Shit. That was not what I was going for, but I'll suss it out. That went beautifully, and that makes you the last one. That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Examine the security terminal. Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Ganky, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Oh, that was so satisfying. Do we? Ah. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. And flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Nice. 
Have I gotten a new toy? Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secure. Blocking fields operational. Good. Vitals, talandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. Still missing some ship leads. I'll have to Come on. Yard master a visit. But otherwise, wait, what's this? I don't know exactly what was going on right there. The most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. We're well connected. Or both. Can I? That's nice that you can connect these web lines. That is a really, really great thing. Hello, party lady. <laughs> So let's see, how many of you are there left? There's one over there. So we might as well take him out while we're up here. You never told me who you best outside of Ulgor were. There we go. And now there's just two little uggos left. Well, I guess you're first because they're gone. No one else left. Only Craven proud. All right. Where to next? Looks like this is the only way. It doesn't get much cleaner than that, now does it? <laughs> I love it. And since I kind of suck at the combat in this game, I really like when I'm given the opportunity to do like stealth takedowns. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpowered gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Etne was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. Craven's adding this to his arsenal. Ugh. That's the Tiara Abitahi. One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to buy a Taya? Guess Craven could. Or maybe he just threatened someone. Are they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa. And not a single scratch? Can I have one of those armors? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. <laughs> Would you look at that? Hey MJ, I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. But he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. I'm a 
Nazi hunting. Whatever it is, it definitely involves Bad guys. Me. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. I really like that you can even put those web lines at an angle so you can't just like go across you can go up and down as well because that gives you a lot of opportunity to do different types of takedowns I want to see if I can yes I can Because I feel that bird could probably have caused me a lot of grief <laughs> if I hadn't taken that out first. Let's see if we put one over there and we yank you up. You could use a break. I really like the fact that none of these guys react to the fact that there are weapons lying on the ground at that it's starting to get quite lonely down there let's see there are four people down there there's one over there So I guess we'll just work our way down to the people in the middle. Shit. I did not mean to do that. Not at all actually. Uh. Can I? Nope. That is never a good thing where you get a target ready for. Are you shitting me? Who in the hell fires a goddamn RPG indoors? Stop shooting that thing. Oof. Okay. Uh
That is what I think of your RPG shooting. I could really use some <laughs> answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Chris. And the reason shit went what sideways there for? was because I... Uh, as you saw, I what? sapped the wrong guy. I kept bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt. But Black Cat's a thief. What? Never gonna win best in show with that attitude. What's that like a saber tooth meat grinder? Nice doggy <laughs> kitty robot. Oh shit. All right. Those teeth are no joke. Heal, roll over, play dead. Oh. They have some kind of focus blocking. Shit. Of course things go sideways. Yeah, that dog was shooting out some kind of EMF thing. that I'm guessing blocks your focus meter from filling up. This time we're gonna be more effective. Pulse attack takes out your abilities. So let's take out the dog. Yeah, play dead toaster. Thank you, Stephen King, for making the whole world clownophobes. <laughs> and the dogs also have a suicide mode. Well, we're thinning the herd. Okay, Poochie, that's the way you want to play. There we go. That is how you do it. <laughs> Scorpion, 
Martin Lee, Black Cat. This Craven guy's putting together quite the team. But I'm wondering the best you can do. Does Craven set up an arena in the favor of the one he's hunting? They said he would kill him. Imagine my disappointment. So that's the end of Scorpion, I guess. He's not teaming up with supervillains for some hunt. They're his prey. Felicia. Huh, <laughs> cat. Come on, can we end this cutscene soon? This video is really going on overtime. Are you ready? Is what she said. Seriously? My, no one says surfing the web anymore. Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. See, you got your good lipstick on. You must really like this guy, huh? Miles? Next time, I promise. Miles. I love you. That hybrid suit is so cool. And you know what? I'm gonna end this episode right here. But uh, I want to thank you very much for watching. And I will see you again in my next video. So until next time, this is the Wolfman signing off.